Can I do a medium white hazelnut bark iced coffee with almond milk? Right, thank you. Thank you. You too. I literally needed coffee so bad. I was having such a bad headache. I'm also probably tired, but like coffee will solve the problems. Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, hello, my name is Ashley. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. Since you clicked on this video, you might as well hit the like button and subscribe down below. We are gonna do a little week in my life. We're actually starting the week in my life in the middle of the week on Wednesday. I am at Ulta. I need to go pick up some like chapstick moisturizer for my lips because I ran out. Like my car chapstick, my purse chapstick, my backpack chapstick is all out so we need to replenish I want to try these things I've heard they're like a dupe for the summer Fridays so we're gonna pick one of these out but I just don't know which one I want I only got one thing and it's not the lip balm I just you know I just thought logical so it was like four or five dollars for the little tiny thing right and it's supposed to be like a little summer Fridays dupe whatever and the summer Fridays granted it is like 20 almost 30 dollars for that one but there's more in the container for this one it was five four or five dollars but it was like that small so I'm thinking I put chapstick on a lot so I don't know I just thought I can get me some blistic pack of four for the same price so I'm getting more for my book you know so I put it back they had these um impress press on falsies and i got the airy wispies and they look like that and i'm actually like kind of excited to try these out we'll see if these actually stick on my eyeballs we're in h&m right now i'm not really seeing anything and i'm actually proud of myself because i'm vlogging out in public in the stores and usually i don't do that but this year's word is gonna be confidence and we're gonna exude confidence and grow our channels why is this low-key the cutest top I don't think I'll be able to pull it off, but I love it. I think people who wear this is so edgy, so cute. Not finding anything, so on to the next. Just a simple black skirt. I hate my little pudge right there, but we're working on that. It's cute, it's plain, it's what I was looking for. But so I have a Galentine today that is coming up in like a week or two. And I, was, I figured I would try to look for dresses and I found this one little dress. I thought it was so cute because of this little piece right here but these didn't work on my boobs. And then I wanted to try this little dress that was viral on TikTok. Girl, it made my booty look so good, but how this is like super open, the side boob was just too much, so. But I think this is adorable. We came to Forever 21 and I found this little number. It's giving very much Gasparilla. I think it's very piratey. It's a halter top and I don't know. I kind of like it. I'm not really a fan of these right here and I feel like I can just pull them off. But I also don't want to mess up the shirt if I do pull them off. Or maybe if it was just this one and all of these were gone. But I kind of really like it. With the black skirt and some boots. What do you guys think? You hear me? Now, this top is something I would never buy for myself. I always say can't see because I'm wearing all black right now, but I think it's so cute and it's really flattering. I think I really like it. I like V's out right here. And then these full little buttons and a full little pocket. If I had better lighting, I would show you. Do I need it? I think I need it. This is the top that I just had on. I just think it's so cute. I don't know. I don't know, guys. What do you think? from Trader Joe's and I literally put it on everything. So now it's time for my favorite part. I put my salads in the big bowl so we can get the heck out of it.
little aesthetic click clip of like getting an ASMR and stuff, but Raiden is currently howling because he's in the kennel. So we're going to head off to the gym. I'm gonna do a little lower body focused workout. Um, I haven't really been like separating my muscle groups and stuff. I just do like one upper body, one lower body, and then a full body. And then the other days I do like cardio and that can be going to the track for sprints or going to Muay Thai, um, just any type of cardio. I also play kickball for the city and that's also considered some of my cardio too because I run a lot there too. But we're gonna go ahead to the gym, get a good little workout in. I'm currently drinking a little protein smoothie that I've prepped um, and everything because I don't really have time to make some breakfast and I don't wanna make like a full on breakfast. I feel like I'll throw up if I do, but. Okay, let's go. Workout is complete. It was pretty good, pretty quick. I wanted to be out of there by 11 or, you know, more people come to the gym because they're going to start trickling in. I am really craving a salmon bowl, but I don't have any more white rice and I don't feel like going to Trader Joe's and going to get some white rice, so I'm having a little bit of a dilemma. I just wish it would just, like, magically appear. The best part about leaving the gym is I think about what I'm going to eat when I get home because I look forward to eating after the gym, which may be a little counterproductive, but... You gotta get your protein in anyways, so. I did indeed end up going to Trader Joe's and getting the rice, but I'm gonna show you guys a quick little haul of what I got from Trader Joe's. This is probably the smallest amount of stuff that I've ever gotten there. Um, I just got some sourdough bread because apparently sourdough bread is better for you and I just ran out of my other ones. So we got some bread and I love me some sandwich sandwiches. I'm a freaking sandwich girl through and through. I love sandwiches. I probably have one almost every day, which I don't know if that's healthy. The main thing I went in there for was to get the um, jasmine rice. These are just so quick and easy. I just pop one in the microwave and I only use like half of the bags when I make something. So it's like a meal prep. And then I got some sweet potato fries because I like to eat these with my dumplings. And then as I was walking out, I saw this mandarin orange chicken bowl and I figured this would be quick and easy. Something so I can make. It's 28 grams of protein in it and only 540 calories. I don't know if that's really good, but it's probably not. There's a lot of carbs. Oh well. We're gonna make this. So I'm gonna I have to go take a shower. I have to get ready for class. We're kind of in a little time crunch, but I'm also really hungry, so it's making me weak and I have to eat something so I can stay awake during class. So it's like five o'clock now, but I think the last piece of my outfit finally came. So I'm hoping that this is it. The lighting sucks right now too, so sorry. Okay. Doesn't smell weird either. I got a red oversized jacket. Be honest, is this ugly or is it so like stinking cute? Let me get better lighting. Hold on. And there's pockets. I love it. Oh, and then earlier in the vlog when I talked about me getting a new, some more lip balms, and then I was gonna get the e.l.f. one, but it just didn't make sense for the price. So I went to Marshall's and I got a pack of six for $5.99. So the price of the one little one that I was gonna get from Ulta, I got a pack of six for the same price. So, yeah. I still have this on, but Tim just got off of work. He has to go pick up his mom and do some stuff and then he's gonna head over here. So I'm gonna clean my room a little bit because I don't like going to trips and coming back and my room's ugly and disgusting. So yeah, I have, I did laundry so I have to fold all that stuff. Literally hate folding laundry, but I need to do that and put it away. And then I'm going to take an everything shower, pack my stuff. I'm probably gonna do my makeup here just cause when I get into his car, it's gonna be dark and I just rather be able to see what I'm doing in the light. So. We're gonna take an everything shower, clean my room, fold my clothes, do my makeup, and hopefully in the span before he gets here. Post shower, we are about to start getting ready. Tim is on his way, so it's crunch time. I need to start getting ready. This is my first time using this, so if I mess up my face, I'm gonna scream. So not gonna lie, I kind of hate my makeup. And this morning when I went to class, I sweated a lot, and the texture of my hair and the extensions of the weave are just like not blending and of course it's just all showing now and I'm kind of bummed and I kind of want to cry but I don't want to be over dramatic so we're just gonna make do with what we got and yeah. Tim and I are in the car 
we just stopped at Taco Bell. Um, we've been driving for, yeah, about an hour. We're gonna be in Tampa at 11. But yeah, we needed food ASAP in our stomachs. And now we're at the gas station. Just give me my burrito. Okay. We made it to the hotel. I had to run back to the car because I left my pants. I changed them to sweatpants in the car, so I had to go back to go get my actual pants for our going out adventures. <laughs> we just went to one bar. We're gonna go to another one. We're just gonna bar hop for tonight. Good morning. Last night did not go well. <laughs> we went and got some breakfast from the hotel, and then we're gonna go wake up the twins, and then get ready for Gatsby. Tell them about last night. I threw up. We're ready for Gatsby. I just finished my makeup and let me show you guys the fit. This the fit. I'm just wearing all white and this little jacket I got from Amazon. I showed you guys yesterday, I think, and I don't know what she is. Happy Gatsby. <laughs> This is Tim's first time at Gasparilla and he's experiencing it with me. Let me show you. <laughs> Let me see your shirt. He's here for my booty. That's it. We're taking it light today because yesterday I died. Speak for yourself. Um, I'm probably gonna drink just a little bit. I do want to stay sober and not feel sick and disgusted like I did this morning, so. like put this in your in your google thing like your maps and now we're here and it's like a little market and he knows i love markets so we're out here exploring and it's really 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 cute surprise somehow we found ourselves on tj max i made him come in here but i went to the bathroom real quick and i just want you guys to guess where i'm gonna find him i know exactly where he is where he's gonna be waiting for me always i told him i would find you in the seating area <laughs> i don't want to go i'm comfortable <laughs> yes ma'am Why did you make me come here? Because I love it here and you love me so you do what I love. I'm in the dressing room. We're looking for some Valentine's Day dresses. So I got a bunch of pink variations. Tim and I came to another farmer's market that's on the beach. We've never been to this one and it has a lot of vendors and a lot of food trucks and we're really, really, really excited. I said I needed you 
baby, that was never true 